Hey everybody, it's Bander of Podcastage, and I'm back with another product test video for you guys, as well as another awesome shirt. So today I'm testing out the SF920 as requested by Blasian Gaiman. Unlike the other mass-produced microphones out there, this is actually an XLR input microphone. However, I did try to use my own XLR so I could go XLR to XLR, and it didn't fit. So it seems like the only cable you're gonna be able to use on this microphone is the cable that it comes with. But compared to the other mass-produced microphones, this is by far my favorite of the lot. First off, the sound quality. This sounds a lot better than the 666 or the 620 or any of those other models that I've tested out before. So even though this is in the same price range as the other Tonor mics that I've tested out, this sounds exponentially better than those microphones. Another feature that I absolutely love about this mic is that it has gain control on the microphone. So right here, it has the gain control right there. So you can change the volume while you're actually using it. I just think that's a great and essential feature to have if you're not gonna be using a USB interface. Just like all the other microphones that I have tested, it does come with the stand and the cable as well. So you should be good to go once you order it. Unfortunately, this mic didn't come with a spec sheet. So I had to look it up online and the frequency response for this guy is 50 Hertz to 16 kilohertz, which isn't the best, but it's still a pretty good frequency response. I think that's the same as the SM48 or the SM58. I'm not 100% sure off the top of my head, but it is a very good frequency response. And I think you can hear that it does sound tonally very good. So even though it doesn't actually say this in the spec sheet, I believe it is omnidirectional because it should be picking up the sound all the way around the mic. So you're gonna be able to pick up a much wider range of sound if you're in a room. Now let's go ahead and see how well this mic picks up audio from a distance. Right now the mic's sitting on my desk at about one and a half feet. The mic's still on my desk and now I'm sitting at about two and a half feet. All right, now I'm sitting at about four feet away. So overall, I think this is a great sounding mic for $15. This is hands down my favorite one of these mass produced mics that I've tested out so far. So if you are looking for a very cheap microphone, this is a great option. It's $15 or around there on Amazon. I'll throw links in the video description. So yeah, I guess that'll do it. If you found the video helpful or you enjoyed it, go ahead and give me a thumbs up. Uh, click subscribe by clicking the logo in the corner. Also, if you have any additional questions about this microphone, leave them in the comments and I will answer them as soon as possible. Also leave some comments down below letting me know what mics you'd like me to review next and I will see you guys next Tuesday. Thanks for watching. See you later. Bye.